The A3000 offers a very solid bass performance and reproduces sound with a fair amount of weight behind it. The overall level of immersion was decent and that sound field setting that we mentioned earlier in the video really helped to dramatically improve the overall oomph of the soundbar. We've been testing this out for the last week or so with plenty of different movies and content across a wide range of genres and the soundbar was able to deliver the perception of a wider soundstage without the need for sideways firing drivers. The soundbar seems to come to life more in the higher volumes for me on the whole. Now, after testing a variety of contrasting scenes from very quiet vocal scenes to full on action sequences, the soundbar was able to follow the action around the screen well, but it was also within these more complicated Atmos scenes where I did find that it started to struggle. It's not that it sounded bad, but I felt that it was finding it difficult to deal with complicated soundscapes with a variety of layers as sounds did appear to get a little bit lost in the chaos. 